everyone welcome back to my channel or if you're new here welcome my name is Hannah please make sure that you subscribe before you leave um, in today's video we're gonna be doing a massive Kmart haul like everyone in Australia Kmart is the place to go if you want home decor or just pretty much anything really because it's cheap and it's good um, so yeah that's what this video is today uh, the last couple of weeks I've been Spending a little bit of money, a lot of bit of money, um, and I picked up all of these items that I'm about to show you today. Uh, yeah, so that's what this video is. Obviously, it's in the title at the bottom. Um, uh, yeah, I thought while James is away this weekend that I would film in the lounge room instead, cause he's not here to uh, judge me. He doesn't judge me anyway, but still, you know. Anyway. <laughs> Enough jibber jabber. Let's get into the video. I don't even know where to start. I got so much stuff. I might just start with the like really big stuff just to get that out of the way because it's just like so much here. Uh, it's actually kind of ridiculous. But you know, I can't help myself. I shouldn't be allowed to go shopping without James. Okay, <laughs> let's go. We'll start with this because it's closest to me. Um, I picked up these little like flower frame things I don't know it's like a picture frame and like the flower is like on printed on the glass and it's just like clear glass if you can see that I hope you can because I can't really see the viewfinder is too small um I don't remember how much these were maybe like seven to twelve dollars I don't know <laughs> I'm not quite sure um I might try and link everything down below if I'm not lazy um but yeah, I got a couple of these because I thought that they might look cute in my beauty space when it's done. Um, I got two, one to go on each side of my mirror. Hopefully it works. I think it will, but I'm not really sure. Um, I just thought they were a little cute because it's just black and white roses in like a little plain black frame. Um, and yeah, I just thought it would look nice. Two of them in my beauty space. Stay tuned for that when I finally do another makeup collection and beauty room tour. Please also excuse the fact that I am still sick, so my voice sounds a little weird. Yep. Okay, so, next I got this round black metal tray. Um, it's just like a metal tray like this, you can probably see it. Um, and it's just got mirror on it. I got one of these like in a haul ages ago, but I ended up being, um, not like, I ended up changing the rose gold theme I was going for. I'm not going for rose gold anymore. I'm kind of just going for like silver, um, black, grey, white sort of thing. So I ended up giving that one to my mum and getting this one instead. Because this is more like for my theme, if that makes sense. Um, and I've just got it like sitting on one of the tables at the moment. Yes, this is just the box. But I kept it just so I could show you and not move what I already did. Because I'm lazy. Now I can throw that out. And I've got a couple more boxes too because I've already put stuff together like the table just in front of me uh, and just over there. <laughs> but I'll show you the boxes. I'll show you what I got and I actually really like them. First thing I got is this little like, you can probably see it in the corner there. It's this little square side table thing for in the lounge room. That's probably better. <laughs> this one here, it's just the industrial side table. I got it to go next to the lounge because I just feel like... Um, it looks cute like it actually really does look cute I've already taken it out and put it over there and it's really cute I just don't like the color like the color of it because it's not like gray or white or black or whatever but I'm gonna do like a little DIY with this one maybe do it like marble or, or just black or white probably not white but I'm gonna do a DIY with this one um, I think this was like $25 or something so it was really cheap um, and it just looks really good next to my lounge chair. So um, I think it will look better when it's marble. Because it doesn't really go with the rest of the house. But for now it looks fine. I also got, if you can see this, the um, coffee table version as well. Um, and it just has, it's exactly the same. I also have like the hallway table as well, which I really like. Which I've put in my little um, feature wall thing in the front. Um, I thought it was really cool, just a regular coffee table, it looks really like simple and pretty but obviously once again I'm going to do a DIY with this as well, maybe marble or black. I think this one was 
$29, so pretty cheap, and it actually looks really nice, like the style looks really good in this house, it's just the colour's not right, but that's okay, that's what DIYs are for, um, and yeah, I'll be doing that soon. Next up, I've got this big ass print, you can probably not see this, it's like a canvas, and it's just got like pink and purple flowers all over it, um, and just like a black background, it's quite large and I thought it was really cool, um, I think this was like 15 to 20 dollars something around that and I just thought it was like a nice little pop of color to go in the bathroom because our bathroom is like the way that I've styled it it's quite um, simple and black and white and gray so I just wanted like a little pop of color in there just to like brighten it up a little bit and we've got like a spare wall on the other side of the mirror um, and I just think like putting it on that wall reflecting off the mirror will like make the room just look a bit prettier I don't know I'll see how it looks but I do really love this print and I think it will look perfect in the bathroom and last of all for big items I have this uh, big old wall clock here um, it's just like a metal um, frame I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be like an outdoor clock but every time I've gone into Kmart recently I've seen this clock and I just think it's gonna look perfect sorry James I'm busy um, I think this is going to look perfect on just like a plain white wall or a plain black wall, a uh, grey wall. Just like that simple but like industrial, industrial style, kind of like to match the coffee tables and stuff like that. Just that, you know, simple. It's simple, it's plain black. Like it's, it's cool. I like the, um, the Roman numeral like times and what, times? What? What was that? I don't know. Whatever. I just really like this and I thought it was cool. Um, and it's just pretty. I'm just going to go in the house and it's just simple it's gonna look good I don't know what else to say about it I think it was like 20 bucks or something next item is these cushions right here I do have them in white as well I got them at the same time but I already put that back there and I thought it looked cute so I didn't want to touch it but um I got the gray ones as well they're just like a textured um, pillow which I thought was cute um, these are like, well, perfect for the couch just because the couch is so plain with some fluffy cushions as well um, and just to add a little bit more texture and colour, not really colour because, I mean, there's a couple of pink ones, but, you know, just a bit of texture because it's so plain. I think these were about like $12. I got a couple of each colour just because I think they'll be nice. They'll also be nice, like on a bed as well, just for that little bit of extra texture. Um, but yeah, I thought they were cute and I really love grey, so. It's more of like a blue grey, but it actually like goes really nice with the couch, so, you know? I don't know. I think I like it. I do like it, I think. I also picked up a little knot cushion. I've seen everybody buying these from Kmart and I, I didn't really like them to start with, but um, then I kind of realized when I had put all my cushions on my bed last night, I did go and buy this today, by the way. Uh, <laughs> when I went and put my stuff on my bed last night, I realized that it looks really weird and I just need like a little something in the front that's a bit different because everything's like, grey and white, there's not really anything that's pink, um, so I wanted to add, or anything that's coloured at all, I just thought the pink looked cute with grey and white, so I got the pink one instead of the grey one, because it's too pink and grey, um, but yeah, I thought this was really cute, it was only $8, and it just gives that little bit of like something something, I don't know, it's a little different, I like it, I might even go get something more for the couch, just like pop one here and there on the couch, who knows, but these were only 8 bucks, and I thought they were kind of cute for that. I actually, I thought that was stupid to start with, but I really do like them now. It's amazing how many times you go to Kmart and then you decide to change your mind on what you hated to start with. I go to Kmart too much. Next up I have this um, cool cover set in a king size because we got a king size bed. Um, I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to keep this one because I'm not really sure if it's going to go with everything that I've got if that makes sense, but I thought it was cute, it's like a um, black um, with roses on it, like black and white sort of like grey scale um, with the roses, and then on the other side it's got it white, like so it's reversible, so you can have it white with the grey roses or black with the grey roses, if that makes sense, um, and I just thought like this would be really cute, I can swap it around, um, but yeah, I've just got to think about whether this is going to go with everything else that I'm going to put on the bed. And just as like an alternative, because like in my last haul I had the uh, suede feeling blanket, which I really love. 
um, but it's like plain so for like something a little bit different with like a bit of pattern on it um, I'll see how this goes yeah I'll, I'll see if I end up keeping this I'm not sure yet I'm also not 100% sure about this throw um, what's this this is a chain knit throw um, I got it in the grey colour, it does also come in a blush pink colour, which I think is cute too. Maybe I could get that for the couch, I don't know. Um, but yeah, once again, I got this one and I'm not really sure if I'm going to keep it yet. I'm just going to find out if it's the right colour grey. Because, um, yeah, the bed's just really um, grey at the moment, like grey and white. It doesn't really have a lot of colour or anything in it. Um, and I feel like it needs to have a little bit more of like depth, like a darker grey or something in there. And I'm not sure if this is dark enough yet, so... I'm going to have to see how that goes. I think this was like $25 for this one. But it is like a nice crocheted throw. Oh, um, the blanket, uh, the quilt cover set was $22 for the king size too. So that was really cheap. Um, it's probably not the best quality though because it's like $22. It's probably shit and it's probably going to like fall apart the first time I wash it. But mm, who knows? Then I got some European pillowcases. Um, I wanted these in the grey, but then I realised like my bed is literally grey and white, like I've said a million times. Um, so once again, I wanted to put some colour in there. I thought that this pink would go nicely with the little pink blush cushion. Um, it's kind of like a purpley pink, I guess, but it's like a velvety, car, a velvety sort of material and like little pat, uh, sort of like a. I hope you guys can see it. It's got like a little bit of like a texture to it. Um, but yeah, I just thought these would be cute just at the back, give it a little bit more colour. They're also like kind of like hidden just to bulk up the back um, because obviously like a bed's pretty boring if you don't have a lot of cushions on it. Well, I mean, it doesn't have to be, but I just feel like my bed's really boring if I just have this like plain, plain grey suede feeling bed cover. Um, so that's what I got those for. Um, I think these were like $7 each. Um, but yeah. We'll see how they go. While I was there, I also picked up some actual European pillow pillows. Um, because I did have some, but I don't know where the hell they went. So I picked up some new ones. I feel like these are better quality than the ones I did have anyway. I think these were like $12. Um, but yeah, I needed a couple of these. I did pick up two, um, obviously for the two pillowcases. And yeah, I'm going to see how they go. These um, feel a lot... Uh, thicker than my previous ones so I'm sure that these will be way better look pretty good so and they're only for display so I mean you're not gonna sleep on them you don't need like good quality pillows if you're not gonna sleep on them if that makes sense like it doesn't really matter um, it only really matters to me if I'm gonna be sleeping on it uh, yeah that's about it I also picked up just some more like plain old pillows um, once again, these are just like for extra um, pillows because we've got like the pillows that we like to sleep on um, obviously in like the, the sheet set pillowcases and then like the bed, the quilt cover sets come with like pillowcases as well. So I got like a couple of, these are two packs. So I got a couple of the, uh, one of these, so it's got two pillows in it. Um, this was $10. It's just for display purposes. I'm not going to sleep on these either. These aren't obviously going to be like pretty, like good good pillows to sleep on they're not going to like help you out in any way but I thought they were good for the price especially just for display pillows um yeah not much else I can say about that just to bulk my bed up with some more pillows so got in one of my previous hauls with spotlight and all that um I picked up some display towels Oh my god, my dad watched my last video about those display towels and he was just like why does she need display towels you buy towels to use towels yeah you do buy towels to use towels but I also want it to look pretty and nobody uses my other bathroom we only use the ensuite bathroom so I kind of just want it to look pretty so I get pretty towels that are a bit more pricey to um, make it look pretty Okay, well this towel wasn't pricey because it's from Kmart, but I thought that this was pretty and it looks really good in the bathroom. And it's just this pink, what is it, pink, <laughs> pink, grey and black uh, towel. And it's like checkered, has like little, um, sort of like, uh, the material is kind of like checkered too, if that makes sense. Um, and it has like a little fringing on the end. 
Um, I just thought it was really cute and it looks really good in the bathroom like in front of like a white towel um, Just as like a display towel just to make the room look a little bit more like All right, because like I said before the bathroom is just like black white gray. Um, it's pretty simple and I just kind of wanted to add some color to it um, So that's what this is for and it was only ten dollars um, And it's a really good quality towel for like a cheap towel. So yeah and also um we haven't put a blind up in the bathroom yet and the display towel that I did have in there faded. So that's pretty much destroyed. A $20 towel down the drain. But that's okay. I've got this one now. And I'll make sure that I put the blind up this time. Or down. We'll install the blind so it's there to put down to make sure the sun doesn't fade it. That was just too complicated. Anyway. <laughs> I've only got a couple more items to go. This was quite a large haul. I did spend quite a lot of money. I also wanted to get some like bar stools, but the bar stools I want are just like out of stock already. Like everyone already went and bought them. So I have to wait for them to come back in. But hopefully in my next haul, I'll have those bar stools. Fingers crossed. Anyway, next up I have this grey um, velvet tray, um, which I think is really cute. Um, I'm not sure like what this is supposed to be used for like maybe jewelry or like something like that in the closet but for me I thought that this will be perfect when the coffee table is like marbled like I want to do eventually like sit this like on the coffee table with like maybe some flowers or candles or just like something in there with some like I don't know I don't know just I think it's gonna be cute on the coffee table either that or like on top of like an ottoman just you know something just it's display like Another display decor item, oh my god. I don't know, I just thought it was cute. So, um, yeah, it's gonna be just something cool to sit on something in my lounge room. <laughs> um, and one more item, which has kind of been sitting in the corner of this video this whole time, but I kind of just left it because, you know, whatever. Um, <laughs> it's just this cool, like, vase thing here with some flowers in it. This is called um, the Magnolia in a Glass Vase. So, um, yeah, that's what this is. It's probably prettier on, on that side. Um, but, yeah, I just got these. Um, I actually got quite a few of these, not going to lie. Um, I got a couple for, like, every room, really, because I just thought they were really cool. Um, I originally went and got one just for the bathroom. And, yeah, I kind of <laughs> just, like, really liked the way it looked in the bathroom. So, yeah, I went and got some more, like, quite a lot more. Um, but yeah, I've got them in every room. I've got one like sitting over on my little table with the little black tray. It's like sitting on there. Got some in the other bathroom. Got some in my beauty room. Uh, and yeah, got a couple more to like stick in the bedroom as well. So yeah, I don't know. I just really, really like these. They are $15 each, but I think that is so cool. Like you've got the, the flowers and the bars. Usually the bars cost like $10 on its own. And usually these things, if you get them from like other places, they'll cost like $10, $20, depending on the quality of the flowers. I still think that these are pretty good quality. Um, I mean, it's Kmart for, for you know, whatever, it's Kmart. Um, <coughs> but, yeah, I think it's pretty good for the price. And they are so nice as well. They look so good. Like, uh, yes! Yes, honey! I love. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think I'm getting a little crazy here. I probably, um... Should have had some wine or something, I think. Yeah. I should have had some more. <laughs> or did I? Anyway, guys. That is everything that I've picked up from Kmart recently. I mean, there's probably some more, but... Actually, there probably is. I think I bought some earrings, too, and some other, like, kitchen stuff. Yeah, I did. But I'm not going to show you guys those, because, I mean, it's probably pretty boring. Um, this, this haul is just... Home decor again, like it always is. I mean, when you buy a house, you kind of have to fill your house with home decor and stuff like that. So, yeah, that's pretty much what I'm doing. So, <laughs> there's probably going to be a few more hauls like this as well. Uh, yeah. Alrighty, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please remember to a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.